All right, so we got a question recently about head outside shots and how those can be susceptible to a guillotine counter. Well, so we're going to talk about today is a few things that make not only the head outside shot uh, easier to finish and more effective, but also prevent that guillotine counter. So using my same setup as usual, just throw the jab, get under Carrie's line of defense. Here, very important, whether I'm going to be countering a guillotine or even in a true wrestling match, I gotta keep my head up. So my head is up, and I'm actually using my head to destabilize carry here. Boom, up. Now as I drive, and I bring my hips up, my head stays up and looking in the direction I wanna finish, here. And so once I'm starting to drive, I keep leading with my head and coming across the legs. So carry tries to guillotine, I'm in side control, and it'll never work. Two things really that prevent that guillotine from happening is my head position, and the fact that I'm cutting across Carrie's legs when I finish. Shot. Head position. Let's do a shot now. I'm going to stop and I want you to try to sink that in and I'm going to show off my head positions. Let's stop. Here. So Carrie's goal, if he wants to finish this guillotine, is to cover my head and start putting pressure on it. So I can't let it drop. i got to keep it up body off balance. Now, if I can just get my legs across his hips, or this leg covers my covers my back, I'm going. 